Good morning, boys and girls. This morning we are going to finish, oh no, we're not going to finish it, but we're going to carry on with that spray job on that van. It's dinner time again because I've been twatting around trying to list this bloody robot on eBay. Aiden's going to do it for me now, so I've sent him all the information. Yeah, so our plan is today to carry on cleaning it down, filling the holes, sanding it, uh, and putting some undercoat on the rust patches, what I professionally filled. And lay dags with us today, look. Because he wanted to come out. He followed Archie out like a little lost sheep. That means he wants to have a venture out today, which is a very rare thing for lay dag, because normally he doesn't really like to go off the sofa for very long. So he's feeling very brave today. It might be because the sun's out on. Oh, yeah. I don't know why he's feeling so, so brave today, venturing out, lay dag. Right, we'll go, go to the shop arch first. Let's go get that job done. Hold on, Lee Dag, going over the train lines. Whee! Oh, Lee Dag. That was a big boy of you, Lee Dag. He was so brave that morning. I'm playing the waiting game. Arch is playing his game. He's earning money. Make the sound up. A dollar being made right there, look. Listen to that. <laughs> look, listen. Going into his bank about that, is it? Yeah, that's his bank, look. Aha, uh -huh, this job, Arch. Do you remember that? <laughs> that can be your job now. Right, we're upgrading from sticky pad to Velcro pad. It's the future arch of Velcro pad is. Hey Chris, you've got the good job, my mate. Why do I get these crusty jobs? Hmm, I'll have to fuck about that in a minute, Arch. Right, I'll move that wagon out then for you. I'm getting on really well with this spray job, really well. I'm really chuffed about it. Now I've got to do some shunting. How'd you want this fucking thing? Where's the key to it? Look here, look, Arch. Look at these. Look at these mirrors, look. We ain't got mirrors. We've got computers for mirrors. Look, can you see it? No mirrors, look. There are mirrors. Oh my God. Computers. What the hell? That is so drama. The future. The future's bright. The future's electric. And then when that goes out, when you go down the road, it's like, oh dear, can't see in the mirrors. Why do you have to press the screen, sir? Yeah? <laughs> look at that, it's not beautiful. I know, look at that dash. Oh my God, look at this, look. Look, I'm there, look, another screen. Look, it's a flat screen. There's about 10 screens in this one cab. What the hell? Don't tell me that's a touch screen. That don't even look real. It looks like it's like printed on there. What's that flashing for? What's that mean? And the other side, what's that flashing for? Ramble. <laughs> <laughs> I know, with no mirrors. It's like a head with no ears. Right, where's the reverse? Oh, everything's just nasty, isn't it? The park brake's even nasty. I don't like it. Keep it. Not very clear either, is it? You know what I mean? It's not like you, it's not like your eyesight in a mirror. I can hardly see Archie there, look. Look. Look, you can't even see him hardly, look. Look, you just see him, aren't you there? I just got there. I don't like these electric mirrors, mate. 
horrible, aren't they? What's the idea of that then? What's what's that improve? Doesn't you should see when you have LEDs and everything, you don't know what what's happening. You think you're going straight and you're not. Is that the key? That's an SOS one. Where's the key for it then? It should already be in there if you're buying it up. I don't even know where the key's put. Where are you put the fucking thing? To let me start, didn't it? I don't know what world we're coming into now though with this thing, with electrics like this. But look at the mirror lot. Trouble is, you know, backing out of that workshop, obviously the dark outside, you couldn't see a thing because it was it was just bright light from the outside. Obviously you can see when you look into a normal mirror you can see, and you can see when you look outside with your own eyesight. But with these cameras you can't see it. What's the fucking point in it? And as well, what's annoying is, you know when, like I was doing then, backing around a tight bit, you normally gauge your wing mirrors as you're getting close to like a fence or like that, obviously. You know what I mean? When your wing mirrors start touching the trees and that, you think, ooh, a bit close here. Obviously, no wing mirrors on this, is there? So what warning you got beforehand? Nothing. You're a smash your cab, that's what you've got. Bizarre, isn't it? Bloody computer screens for cracking mirrors instead of mirrors. Shit idea. Oh yeah, look, iPad and another iPad. We've got two iPads on the dashboard. Two Can iPads. Take it off. Computers for mirrors instead. What's up with just a glass? We've had a glass for years, like mirrors. I know, is it? They're good. They're good. All that happens is if they crack them, you just replace the glass. I know what happens if you crack one of them uh, cameras. Ooh, here you do. Oh, fucking thing. What's up with it? I meant to get it off. Probably will need a bigger screwdriver, one that fits lovely and snug into there. I'm going to go and get that. A lovely one that fits nice into there. I know, guys. I know what he's doing wrong here, but I just didn't put it in. Oof, job. That's it, you must have done it. What did you do to it? I spin it around. You did it. Told you guys that I know what I'm doing. Oh, you know what you're doing, all right? You've done it. Velcro. And when you want change? Right, this needs to be two-toned. She wants it two-toned now. She wants this bit black clock there that panel black and then the rest of it white. So what we plan is now is to mask this off because I've cleaned all this up, mask this off and spray this black because then tomorrow, hopefully the black will be dried. I can mask the black off and then spray the white. Right, on this compressor here in this workshop, it's got no uh, air reducing thing on it or no moisture trap. So what I'm thinking is, I've got one built into here, look what I've never used. So I'm going to get one of them, put it on there, and then open the tap up, put their airline into there so this little compressor is not going all the time. What you can also do, you know, if you're not very good, at getting a straight line on your paintwork like that, you can also buy some pinstriping and do it afterwards. That's what I did on my van lot. Because I, I was struggling to get a straight line on my van. You know, a perfectly straight line, when you look down at it, it's hard to do. You know, like that, perfectly straight. That's why I thought, oh, I know what I'll do. I'll put pinstripe down it. So I sprayed it first, the line, and then I put pinstripe down it, just to make it nice and straight. And it finishes the edge off as well. Arch is my little height worker, aren't you, Arch? Right, that's it, all masked off now. Let's paint it black. This is 2K paint. It's two parts paint to one part hardener and then 10% thinners. Uh, and I'm going to spray it with this real modern spray gun. You do need... It is best to have these jugs, look, because... Obviously, it's got the mixing ratio on it, lot, and it's got plus 10%, plus 20%, and they're not much money. 
So by the time you're done siphoning jugs and measuring it, oh, it's a nightmare. Look at these, cheap as chips, chuck them away, jobs are good. Then. Now I'm just gonna do a little bit because I don't know how good this spray gun is. It might be absolute shocking because oh, well, you can see how long I used it for. Uh, so I might need to get another spray gun. So I'm just gonna mix a little bit. This spray gun is shit. The fan on it is absolute shit on this. It's Kelta. A spray is worst nightmare to see that. Oh. But not ours. <laughs> but not ours, because we're not sprayers. <laughs> <laughs> if I was a sprayer, I'd, I'd be worried about that. <laughs> uh, you know the old, uh, you know the old finger skimming thing, what you should always try and do? You know, when you've got a drip, you just think, oh, I'll just blend it in with <laughs> Never works. I know it won't work, but I'll, you've just got to try it, haven't you? It's there, and you think to yourself, oh, I'll just blend that in with my finger a bit. It's very patchy. And I've got runs in it, oh. Look all the little dust particles all in there. It's either dust or moisture. In fact, it looks like moisture. Oh well, just rub it down again with that, with that fine stuff and just go over it with another coat. Job's good. Hey, Arch. Yeah, sure. Never cry over spilt paint. Right, we're going to carry on with this tomorrow because uh, we've had a... Uh, I'm going to get that spray gun, I know, so we can't do no more. Hey, oh, Joe here, look. He's just uh, clearing a skip out. He says, I got you so much the other day from the skip. Look what I got you. <laughs> I said, oh, of course, Dimash. To go with me Kelly dog. He says, watch out, though. They'll be making babies. <laughs> he ain't got a basket though, this chap, has he? Look at these lot together. Oh, Kelly's got a mate, look. They look beauties. What shall his name be? Oh, let's name him. Can you think of a name for my new little dog? We've got Kelly, and now it's this one. He looks a bit like a boy, that one does. Kelly looks like she wants to feed him, though. Ooh, she's a bit broken. Right, I'm gonna do, what am I gonna do? Come on, new dog, move out the way. Oh, how many dogs can't go in my own van? Yeah, that spray job, uh, I made a right fucking mess of that, Anna. Honestly, what a fucking struggle that is. I ain't got a clue what I'm doing, have I? I've done it all wrong, you know. I'm gonna have to sand all that down, that black down again. I've lent a spray gun off one of my mates, a good spray gun, a Develbis, Devil. Devilbis, whatever it is. Anyway, it's a good spray gun. Uh, I've lent one of them off a mate, and I'm going to... He said, no, you don't run wash. You, you, you spray it black first, you don't mask it off, spray the panel black, and then mask the black off, and then you can spray the white over it. I says, well, will the white cover the black all right? Because I was expecting it like not to cover the black very well. He says, yeah, it'll just cover it normal, obviously. So that's what I'm going to do. When I go back there to that yard, I'm going to take off all the masking tape, and I've got proper line tape coming as well, because I didn't use proper line tape, did I? So I've got proper tape coming, take all that masking tape off, spray it, sand it down, spray it black again, and then uh, go again. But before I do that, I've got to do some inspections. So I'm going to get these inspections done, because I've got to earn some money. I can't be fucking around with that spray job all the time. It's not earning me piss all that ain't. All I'm doing is wasting my breath with that. Wasting my time, wasting my breath. Not a good sign when you see that lot. Check them wheel nuts. It might just be that the corrosion sometimes run from the inside of the rim outwards, so it makes it look like the wheels are loose. But I'll check them with the uh, with the torque wrench.
Well, I waste time doing the rest of them, isn't it? Oh dear. Not the best, is it? I'll get 10 new studs for it. Right, let's see if he wants to move this before I uh, strip it down, Anna. Yeah, he needs it for Monday, so I've got to do it today, Anna. Uh, so I'll get it stripped down. At least with these, it's just the wheel off, and then the drum should just pull off from the hub. We now need the hub off or out, and then I can knock the studs out, knock the new ones back in. Bloody good show. Well, it's not really a good show. It could be better, being as it could have not happened. But still, these things come to test us, don't they? Let's get it stripped down. It's better at falling off there than down the road, isn't it? Always look at the bright side of life. Ah. Them threads are all gone in there. Remember our threads in there? You can draw them off, the, the drum off. All gone. So I'll get the big hammer on her. Just going to wind the brake off to give it a bit more clearance then to move. Is that clear enough for you? And it's got that shoulder on it, look, hasn't it? Yeah, it's alright, so respect. See, Dave, see that? I'm only going to knock that one out because I don't know how many of these studs he's got, if he's actually got any of them. Now, we're struggling to get a stud for this, so uh, one of the lads reckons he's got one at his farm, so he's going to go have a look for a second hand one. Uh, so I'll get on with the inspections, won't I? Like I was going to do. No! Ah, the old no press play job. Uh, yeah, I've got a stud, second hand stud, pour it on. Just put the wheel on that. Well, I was meant to be spraying that van today, wasn't I? But uh, it don't look like I'm going to be able to now. I've got another inspection to do, yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. Tonight we're running on the right track I know we're never gonna look back Left the fucking ignition on, didn't I? On these RV leave the ignition on, it fucking leaves your front uh, spotlights on Front driving lights on, well I don't know why I know why, just to fuck me up with my battery again Yeah, I was meant to be uh, doing that spraying today, wasn't I? But I've got another inspection to do now so I'll have to do that tomorrow morning, Saturday morning. All I want to do is go there, spray the black quick, well, rub the black down, spray it again quick, and then I can let it dry and then do the white next week, can't I? That fucking job is dragging. I've never known a job like it. Not for me, that spray. Oh, just about to stop the engine then, wasn't I? Oh, can you imagine that? At this yard, nobody's here either at this yard. I'll be stuck here, won't I? Right, I've got an inspection to do now on another eight-wheeler. This is the lorry that had the ECU fitted not long back. Uh, when it went, I went to a breakdown to him. It was, uh, the engine just fucking stopped on him. Both were the faults up on his dashboard. This is the one. 
They did have to have an ACU to it. I always like to look at the defect books, just in case. You never know if I'm going to miss summits and the drivers put summits down, do you? You never know. Last job of the day. Let's hope I don't find anything dramatic. It'll need a set of front and uh, second steer pads in it soon. Never used to be that tight. Look at that now. Lovely little dog. Beautiful. What a beauty.